Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna to be showing you a bunch of really easy and fun sponge wall creations that I've done. Um, and you can do them too. None of these cost me more than $5. They basically look like faux wallpaper and I'm so excited to share this with you. So for the first wall, all I'm using is this very simple household sponge. I bought a pack of these at Dollarama for about $5 for five of them. So two of these bathrooms, or yeah, about two of these bathrooms that I'm working in are very small, so bear with me here. Camera angle is not that great. But all I'm doing is sponging down the wall, uh, just in straight lines, just using the wall as my guide and it kind of created this faux slim brick look. So next I used this set of three sponges that I bought at Michael's, I believe it was about $4, to create this next polka dot wall. I'm using plain black wall paint and all I did was started with the largest sponge, uh, worked my way down to the smallest one. You can make this as busy or as simple as you want. That is the best part about all of these sponge walls. You can do whatever fits your style. So for this next one, we're going back to the regular sponge. We use this for quite a few of them. Uh, going back to this one, just doing a little bit of a different pattern. This one turned out really fun. All I'm doing is going in sets of twos and threes around the room and just making the same little brick pattern. I am alternating both vertical and horizontal and I think it actually came together really nice. Alright, and for this one, all we're doing is taking our regular sponge and we're actually going to cut a triangle out of it. I just cut it out of, kind of started at the bottom and went up and created this little triangle. This is what you end up with. You could make more than one size if you wanted. I stuck with one and made it about a medium size, but whatever works for you. All of these looks, I've never used more than a sample size paint. You can get them at Home Depot and they're around $5 at the very most. So very affordable. Wallpaper is really expensive. So these kind of faux wallpaper looks are definitely the way to go, at least for me. You can change them up often and they look great. And for this last look, we're going to go back to just using our regular basic kitchen sponge. So this one I actually did in our master bathroom um, and it's very similar to the first one that I showed you, uh, but I, instead of alternating the brick pattern, I'm stacking them right on top of each other. It gives a little bit different look um, and I think it turned out really cute. I did it in like a light sage green type color and I really like it. Hope you guys enjoyed all of these ideas. Let me know if you try any of them out and stay tuned next Thursday for another video.